ferromagnetism a few substances like iron cobalt nickel gadolinium and chromium dioxide are attracted very strongly by a magnetic field such substances are called as ferromagnetic substances besides strong attraction these substances can be permanently magnetized in solid state the metal ions are ferromagnetic substances and they are grouped together into a small domain called domains it's a region called domains and each domain acts as a very tiny magnet in an unmagnetized piece of a ferromagnetic substance the domains are randomly oriented and their magnetic moments get cancelled when the substance is placed in a magnetic field all the domains get oriented in the same direction of the magnetic field and a strong magnetic field is produced this ordering of domains persists even when the magnetic field is removed you are able to see it here and the ferromagnetic substance became a permanent magnet here is a typical example of a ferromagnetization so a small piece of a tower kind of a flower material is prepared for ornaments kind of you are able to see it's a kind of a flower show kind of a, which is made using the property of ferromagnetization it got the magnetic property a complete magnetic property and you are able to see it's there and one if it loses its magnetic property automatically it will come down you can see it now it's really awesome right you are able to see once if it loses its magnetic property it comes down it's back to normal afterwards it will try to regain its magnetic property as you know the ferromagnetization it's having the real magnetic power now it got the magnetization as you know the ferromagnetization or magnetic property will have or will align equally in all direction 